happened to that case and family? What are they doing with themselves? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Shall we begin? Hi guys. So I know it's been, I keep saying this, I don't know how long it's been since I posted. And I'm so sorry. Christmas kind of came and went and got away from us and all that. I will be posting some Christmas footage. It's mainly the kids opening presents, but I will post that. But today's video is going to be a what I got for Christmas 2016 edition. I can do a kids edition too, but I'm just gonna concentrate today on myself, what I got for Christmas. Disclaimer before this video, this is not meant to brag or to be a show off type video. I just know I really, really enjoy watching these kind of videos. I always have really enjoyed watching them. So I just wanna share with you guys what I got. I appreciate it all. I don't expect anything from anyone. I would be just as happy not receiving anything at Christmas. That's not what it is about. But I will show you what I got this year and Let's get started. And I apologize now if you hear kids in the background, they are all still home on Christmas break. They're in the other room with their Christmas presents, but they're still loud and they don't know how to shut up. So you just deal with it. Um. Okay, so I don't know if I'm gonna go in any particular order. I know some people have it where it's like, I got this from this person, this from this person. My stuff is literally just spread out everywhere. So I'm just gonna start grabbing and start going through it. Um. First off, I got pretty much what everyone else gets. In my stocking, I got, ugh, sorry, assortment of different candies. So I got some lots of M&Ms, some Skittles. I got a couple of these Reese's trees. Reese's, Reese's, what do you guys call it? What, which is it, which is it? I also got from my mom and dad this chocolate orange. I love these things and no one else in my house likes them. They think they taste disgusting. So more power to me because I don't have to worry about sharing. This is the one chocolate item I do not have to hide from my children. So let's just jump right into the main gift portion. I got a couple gift cards this year. I got from Cole's grandmother a TJ Maxx gift card. This will probably end up going towards home stuff since I know we told you guys in a previous video we're gonna start doing stuff with our house now. That is still the plan. So that will be wonderful. This will also go towards house stuff. It is a $20 Hobby Lobby gift card. So I'm very excited to spend those. I got some mom, mom, wife, adult. I got some adult gifts this year. And when adult gifts, I mean cooking. I got an electric griddle. I don't have that in front of me. We've already unpacked a lot of the stuff and it's in the cabinet and I would have to dig through the cabinet to get it out. And I also got a little mini skillet. No, I got a pots and pan set, which we desperately needed because our other one, all the other stuff was like chipping off it and I know it's not safe for you. So we got a set. We got all the dishes or we got all the pots, you know, you got the large size, medium size, you got the skillets, um, like two or, I think there's three different sizes, four different sizes, I don't remember. And then we got like the plastic utensils and the measuring cups. And they are in this beautiful maroon color, which is, kind of matches my shirt. So look at that, I matched. It's Mississippi State colors, so if you know I went to Mississippi State, it's like, woo, Mississippi State, pots and pans. I get those from Cole's parents, along with the electric griddle. I really, really like them. I'll go to my jewelry items that I got next. First, I got this necklace and earring set from Cole's brother and my sister-in-law. So that's really pretty. Kind of matches my shirt. Oh, it does. Look at that. Mm. From Cole's sister. It's a little tangled. But I got this pretty long necklace that I need to untangle. I am the worst about tangling necklaces. I love them but I always manage to tangle them so easily. But no, it's really pretty and it's got like leaves and stuff on it and it's gold. From my brother and his wife, I got this Minnie Mouse, cause they went to Disney Springs. They live in Florida. So they are Disney-aholics, which my family really is too. But I got this pretty bow necklace and it's Minnie Mouse bows all over it. And it's long because I like long necklaces. And then my mom and dad 
got me this Alex and Ani bracelet from um, the Disney Parks. And it is, let's see if I can get it in there. It is Beauty and the Beast and it says, what does it say? Find true beauty within. And it may be a little dirty because I've already worn this a couple times. Been really wanting one of these types of bracelets. Um, when we went to Disney this past summer, I remember looking out with my mom. She really wanted some too. She got a couple for herself for Christmas. She got the Epcot one and the Magic Kingdom one, I believe it is. But she knows how much I am obsessed with Belle. Belle is my absolute favorite Disney princess. Yes, I'm very excited about the new Beauty and the Beast movie coming out. So she got me this. I will now do clothing items. The shirt that I have on is from Cole's sister and it's one of those light and flowy. It's got the zipper. It's really long, which I love. It's got um, the little uh, like button up on the sleeves and I love it because it's the perfect shirt to wear after the holidays when you've had too much to eat and you have that little bit of that pooch stomach coming up. It really covers it nicely and you still look nice and stylish. So love, love, love this top. I got from my Cole's brother and his wife this pretty pink soft scarf. And it's just a pretty pink silky scarf thing. And again, it kind of matches. It kind of all match today. I am on my game today. From my parents, another Disney Bell themed item. I got this Bell shirt and it's long and flowy and comfortable. I need to cut these things off because they're so annoying. And then on the back, it's got the Mickey and see it is from Disney Parks. It's got the Mickey and at the bottom, it kind of opens a little bit, but it's really nice too. It's nice and long and flowy. And again, perfect for that holiday. Uh, I just gained 10 pounds body. So loving that. Cole got me a few clothing items. He got me um, a couple hats. Sorry, that's my coffee maker beeping at me. He got me a couple hats and as it was noted, it actually has his initials on it. So yeah, but he got me this pretty uh, brown taupey color. And then this is like a navy gray. It's gray, I think. It's very gray. It's kind of bluish a little bit, but it's really nice. And then he also got me, oh, I'm dropping stuff. He got me another Disney thing. He got me this t-shirt that has Minnie Mouse bows all over it. They're like little um, balloons and it's dirty because I've been wearing it, but I like it a lot because I am not ashamed to say that I'm in my thirties and I still love glitter and bows and all things little girls love. And I have another clothing item, but I'm gonna come back to that at the end because that is like the grand huge gift. I'm gonna save it for the end of the video. So I got some Victoria's Secrets uh, body mist because I had to throw out all my other ones because they were old and disgusting and I needed new ones. Since I've gotten my hair done with the blondes at the end, it tends to be very, very dry. So Cole got me in my stocking this leave-in conditioner. It's like a really, really nice one. I've used it once and can already tell a difference. Maybe not right now. It's kind of a hot mess because I tried to curl it in like five minutes, but I really, really like this. We went to the mall the day after Christmas. I bought him a pair of pants that actually we noticed had a hole in the back of them. So we had to return those. So while we were there, we hit up Bath and Body Works, of course, because that is really the only time I shop there is when they're doing their huge sales where everything's like 75% off. And I think we got all of this for a little over $30. We did not spend a ton. Um, first we got some soaps because if you are a mom and especially with me, I have four smelly children. We got three of those foaming soaps that smell wonderful and I love. The next thing I got was some shower gel because I am out and this is in champagne toast. This one was 50% off and I don't remember how much the soaps were. Cole got those. There were three for something. And then I love the Christmas scents. I love them, but I don't buy them during Christmas time because I refuse to pay full price for almost anything. So I went a little crazy this year and I bought several of the body cream. I don't like regular lotion. I like it a little bit thicker. So first I got this one was the Shea and Sparkle 
scrub, scrub, in sugar plum swirl. And it's lovely and it's all sparkly. See it? Ooh, again. Again, I'm in my 30s and I love glitter and sparkles and bows. The next scent was the body cream, which this one's I've already used, is the Twisted Peppermint. Oh, I'm going back in the bag. The next one is the Gingerbread Latte. And I got the Frosted Coconut Snowball. And last but not least, the Winter Candy Apple. I love this one, I get this one every year. So yeah, we, we spent just a little over 30 bucks and got all that, which is an amazing, oh, I hit the camera, which is an amazing deal. Next items, I will go with my drinking apparatuses, my drinking glasses. First I got from my brother, which you will notice another theme. It is this, which is still has some of my morning coffee in it. <laughs> if you know me, I love coffee. It is a Disney Belle coffee mug. So it says Belle on the inside. It's like her little dress and her hair and it's got the roses on it. So I love this coffee mug. I think since Christmas, this is the only one I have used. I have drank out of it my two, three cups of coffee a day. Mm. From Cole. And he got me a Kate Spade water thermos because I like having water and I like these in the summer because I like iced coffee and this is what I like to drink it out of. And honestly around the house I like to have cups with lids on it with my kids just in case and I'm always at the computer so I like to have that second barrier where all my liquids are not gonna go pouring out. But it's just this case made at the bottom and it's in navy and polka dots because I love navy, I love polka dots. Again, I'm like five, I'm like a five year old. I, I love all things girly. This one actually Cole got me after Christmas because I ended up getting him one and he told me he had, he saw it when he was out shopping, thought about getting it and then forgot. It is the knockoff Walmart version of those, the Yeti, the tumblers. And you know what? They work just as well. You don't have to spend $50 on a freaking thing to drink your water out of. So this one I think was around 10, but I got him just like the stainless one and he was gonna get me the same, but he said when he was there, he saw this one and this pretty blue and he said, yeah, I knew that I wanted to get you that one because it's more girly. So this is part of my Christmas and it actually still, I don't know if you can see, it still has ice in it. I put this ice in this cup at around probably eight o'clock last night. It is around 11, 11.30 the next day and it still has ice in it. My water is still cold. I'm probably gonna dump it out and get fresh water, but it is still cold. That is amazing. Next gift that Cole got me, right now you are on my typical normal large tripod, but sometimes when I go out, I don't have room for that thing. I wanted something that I could just shove in a diaper bag, in a bag, and take with me. So he got me one of these little Joby, Joby, is that how you say it? I don't know. Um, and it's got the name on it, and it's, it's small, hold on, I'm not focusing, okay. It's small, but it's actually very durable. I've already played with it some, and it's gonna come in really, really handy. I am super excited about this, and being able to take it wherever I go. I kinda wanna get the bigger one too, but this one will be perfect for now. On to the two gifts that I am probably the most excited about. So excited about these gifts. These are the two things that I really, like, if you had to, if you, if you threatened me and were like, you have to come up with two Christmas gifts right now, these would have been the two that I wanted. The first one is from my mom and dad. It is a planner, a planner. It's a fancy planner and it's gonna be perfect for jobs, um, kids appointments, and YouTube. I was really wanting it so I can actually start being better about scheduling. And it's, I know there's some that go into a lot more detail out there and I've I had done like planners before. Like I've never done a planner like this. So I figured for the first year I'm gonna do something like this. And then if I really, really like it, I'm gonna order one of those. And he's Aaron Conrad. I'm gonna order one of those probably for next year and get a lot more customized. But I figured I'd start off with this. But it's really pretty and I like the colors and it's just I think it's gonna be great. I really, really think that it is going to help me 
be more organized and that's something I need in my life because we have a lot going on all the time. And to go with it, she got me the stickers. And so, ooh, can't open it. So I got all the fun like stickers and just little add-on stuff just to make it even more fun. And then she got me these Paper Mate Ink Joy pretty little pens just to, just to get me started. The big gift, my big Santa gift, which was from my husband. I have been wanting these for over a year now. I really didn't think I'd ever get them. They're a little more than I would normally spend on this kind of item. But, I mean, when you see them, they're me. These things scream Ashley. These are Ashley. These are just me. And they are rain boots. Yes, you heard that right. Rain boots. And they are by the company Jules. I think that's how you pronounce it. They are this pretty navy color. And look at this. They have bows on the back. Red bows on the back. I mean, seriously, how could you not love these? And we went shopping the day after Christmas and wouldn't you know, it was raining. It was raining. I would have worn these anyway, but it was raining. So I was so excited that it was raining because I got to wear these lovely, lovely boots that I love them. They are, they're so wonderful. And then I almost forgot, I actually got one more gift from Cole. I mean, he goes above and beyond every year. I got a Fitbit. I got the Flex, I think that's what this one is, the Flex, and you like, hit it and it's saying that I'm a failure because I only have one dot and I haven't done much exercise today. I got him a Fitbit too. Did not know we were getting each other one. I got him the charge too where it has the screen. I don't need the screen and that one would be a little bit too big for my wrist. We're just like everyone else and in 2017 we want to start being healthier. Pretty much everyone else's New Year's resolution but hey you know what we need to. We both have gained weight this year and we are ready to take it back off. So this is exciting. It's actually really cool. It has a cool app that goes with it. I've been playing with it a little bit and I'm loving it. I, I like too because I sleep with it and it monitors my sleep habits. So I can look back and be like, oh, I woke up at 3 a.m. I didn't know I woke up at 3 a.m. But that's it guys. That's everything I got for Christmas. I am so appreciative of everything I got. I did not really ask or expect anything, but I love it all. And that's gonna be where I end this video because I already know it's way too long. Um, I'm gonna be slowly uploading footage. You'll just have to bear with, I, I keep saying this. You'll just have to bear with us through the end of the year. And January is a new year. We're gonna be working out and we're gonna be doing stuff to our house and I'm gonna be posting regularly again, I promise. So I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas. If you do celebrate Christmas, um, let me know uh, in the comments below. What was your favorite thing about Christmas this year? Did you get something you had been wanting really bad? Did you see someone you haven't saw in a long time? Did you just have a really, really awesome time hanging out with friends and family? Let me know. I would love to hear it. And thank you again to all our subscribers. Somehow it keeps going up even though I've been failing to post and comment and thank you guys. And if I have been slow to reply, I am sorry. I pretty much have kind of... I've been all over the place, but I want to let you guys know that I really, really do appreciate it. We all appreciate it and we love each and every one of you and we will talk to you guys soon. Have a wonderful, wonderful day and bye guys.